<laughs> hey there, stackers. What's up? Big Stack McGee here with another silver video for you. I just wanted to share a reflection that I had today uh, about why I do what I do in terms of stacking precious metals and things of tangible wealth like these beautiful silver bars here. I was having a conversation in the office with a colleague, and he made the the notion that you know the dollar sure doesn't buy what it used to. And I kind of had to laugh because. You know, he's barely 30 years old, <laughs> you know, it's, he, even in his short life, he's seen the devaluation of the dollar, and, you know, he can remember a time where it seemed to purchase more, you know, of course, not according to the uh, government uh, inflation index, you know, the where they track durable goods and textiles and things like that, oh, well, no, inflation's really low, but I'll tell you what, for the average person that has to buy food and fuel and all that kind of stuff, you know, you sure have seen a, a incredible increase in the cost uh, for those things relative to the dollar. Um, so I had to tell them about a video that I saw last night by a fantastic YouTuber, Belange P, B-E-L-A-N-G-P. Um, I'm going to put a link to a video that I just watched. It was a repost that he did called The Confiscation Has Already Occurred. And uh, it's just a wonderful parable about... Uh, <laughs> about how the idea of fiat currency just doesn't work <laughs> and and how it can come crashing down and and whatnot and, and how the US dollar really is especially with the, the rate at which it's being pumped out and how many more are in circulation and um, not even just in circulation but just the the sheer volume of dollars that are now considered to be out there even digitally and uh, we all have an expectation on the dollars to be able to return uh, value to us. You know, we, of course, people think that they are valuable in and of themselves, but it's purely a promise, like like Belange P uh, states in his video, it's, it's the promise or the intention of receiving value somewhere down the line. And for people that just stack cash, period, and, and uh, you know, it's just, you're, it's a kind of a scary notion because we all see how what we can purchase with those is dwindling right now. And this is where, you know, the government's saying the economy's on track. You know, the market's at an all-time high. All these things, people are excited. But I don't know. I I would much rather put my faith in something that I can actually hold in my hand, something that I was willing to pay money for. It's worth money because I was willing to pay money for it. I was willing to purchase this. And I have the trust that somewhere down the line, someone else will value this enough to want it if I need to uh, to move it or if I need to receive value in some other form. But it's something that I am in possession of. Um, I don't, not to say that I don't operate in dollars. Of course I do. I have to buy things like everyone else. But, um, you know, I just I just think it's a good idea to, to hedge your bets, so to speak. And, and um, you know, the potential of something like this I think is is huge but really the reason I do it is this is this is my savings this is this is my emergency fund this is my ability to uh, receive value that I know has value it's had value for thousands of years it'll continue to have value for thousands of years of course that's my trust you know I have trust in this not everybody does you know people will laugh at me people will thumbs down this video uh, I just I yeah, it's just the kind of the trend uh, recently but um, I sure believe in what I do, and I, I just want you to watch that video by Belange P. I think it just serves a great, as a great reminder as to uh, why it's important to have tangible wealth at your fingertips. With that, um, I'm going to go ahead and, uh, and end this video. Um, I do want to tell you that uh, what I have stacked out here, all of these um, bars have something in common, and that is that they are all uh, bars of 10 ounce bars of poured silver. And this should give you an indication of what my next unboxing is going to be. I, I've kind of discovered an affinity for unique pieces of uh, 10 ounce silver. And so I am going to uh, be receiving another one, another one of those shortly. And I will unbox that as soon as I get it. And uh, looking forward to it. So with that, I want to say goodnight. This is Big Stack McGee. Thanks for watching my video. You guys have a fantastic evening. Take care.